When it comes to sport, this could be for you. Combine basketball and water polo and you're pretty close to canoe polo. It's a sport in which you need to perfect your Eskimo role, as demonstrated here by one of my opponents. Watch how he tips over and comes straight back up. That takes some doing. Only experienced players can really do that. If you're just starting out in the sport, you are guaranteed to end up in the soup. An early bath, even before you've started. But this is something you have to get used to in canoe polo. Two teams of five collide on the water, trying to get the board into the net at the other end. And one of the most effective ways of clearing the route to goal is to turn your opponent's boat over. It's like five-a-side football, but a goal's six foot in the air and you're allowed to push people in. I'll be completely de-stressed from work. And it's like, it gets everything, all the frustrations of the week out of your system in an hour and a half. Well, the great thing about these kayaks, you can use them to protect, you, to protect the ball from your opponent, but they come at you so fast, like head to head. While most of us are only just waking up to this sport devised by canoeists who wanted to spice up their winter training, there are now 94 clubs across the UK, and it's the final matches of their winter league season this weekend. While it combines paddling and ball skills, tactics and positional play are just as important as speed and fitness. It's hard work, but it's really exciting and it's something you can really get involved with. And you kind of forget you're in, you're in, in the, you forget about the kayak. Just one final word of advice, though. If you do manage to beat the keeper in score, be careful how you celebrate. <laughs> They are so easy to tip up those kayaks, especially when you get rammed by one of your opponents. But great fun, great sport. Check out the website for more information on that. There is the website on the screen, in fact. Thank you very much. I think you look like a natural, Mike. Thank yeah. you very much.